What is up guys, Video Game Jam Poop again back with more Banjo Tui and in the last episode we have tackled on Cloud Cuckoo Land and we're almost finished the game. In this episode we're gonna do Cauldron Keep, but first there's one other thing we forgot. Honeybee! We need honeybee to give our last few uh honeycombs. I'm honeybee, aren't you? You're like the honeycomb. You have enough for one honeycomb. You want to trade? Yes, I do. Sure, honey. Got some games in the end, big bear. Here's your energy. And we got every energy upgrade in the game now. And I think you have more you have more health than in Banjo Kazooie, which is weird. Well, that's that's what I think anyway. Oh no, that's Jam Jars. That's the silo. And now we're gonna go to Cauldron Keep. In fact, first though, I want to try that Witchy Wolf thing again. I want to do. I want to see if we can access that cheat code. If not, then I guess we'll do it after a bit of Cauldron Keep because it's actually a secret. Uh, after a bit of it, and then. All right, no, it's behind the big tent. Right, just go around here to Madame Grunty. Let's see. What a bit. It's always gonna be a beating, isn't it? Or more gold feathers than that. Oh, and it's closed immediately. Are you kidding me, Sir Grunty? Okay. Well, I guess we'll be doing it after then. Well, I guess I'll be, um, we'll be doing this after a bit of grun- uh, not Grunty Industries. Cauldron Keep, then. I need to go to the Quagmire, because that's where it is, alongside Grunty Industries. It's there, in the Quagmire. Because they're both Grunty-themed, I guess. And because we've already done the Claw Boots part, we'll just use this pad right here. Alright. You! Go away! Oh, boy. I'm gonna go up here. And then, just right here, Cauldron Keep Secret Exit. And this is the last area in Banjo Tooie, and there's no jiggies here, so. Activate that pad, and we need Banjo and Kazooie. And so we need Banjo to go this way. Now you're really supposed to use that bag thing that you wet. Banjo! What is wrong with you? Then we need Kazooie to go this way. And then hit the switch. And then we need to touch Banjo. And then boom. And then we need to go all the way behind. And we find a Minjo that we can kill. And then another switch to disable the shocks. So now we can go in. And then we go in here. Right. We're in the gatehouse. Hey, Kazooie, there doesn't appear to be anyone in here. Oh, yes, there is. The music's changed. Every time that happens, we always end up in a fight. Yeah, we do. I wonder how you know that. Anyway. Yeah, Klungo must defend Mr. Scrunchy Castle. Klungo, career questioning minion. Don't you ever learn? Klungo clever learns lots, has learnt new potion. Is it as useless as all the others? Yes, uh, Klungo means no. Must win this time or mistress feed me to monster. And he's a blue potion, and what the blue potion does... He makes clones of himself. And you wanna always make sure you get the real one. Now the real one will stay longer before the other clones come out of him, so. So the, the one that stayed is the one you hit. Notice our energy comes back as well. Oh, and I think his potion homes in on us now. Oh, there we go. We defeated Klungo. Got him. Do, do, 
Clogo noticed something happening after fights with Bear and Bird. And that is? Clogo gets less and less handsome. Now Miss Clungo won't want me anymore. Clungo had enough. Future prospectors not good with Mistress Grunty. No chance of promotion. No days off. No pay. Clungo go find easy desk job. Maybe make stupid games. Well, I guess that's true. I think in Nuts and Bolts, I believe you had your own 8-bit game. I believe. And let's go in here. Tower of Tragedy. The Tower of Tragedy quiz. Oh my god, we've got another quiz show here, guys. With Gruntilda. Thank you, thank you. I'm Grunty, your host, and may I welcome you to my Tower of Tragedy quiz. Let me run through the rules for you all. There are three rounds of general knowledge questions, and the, per the person with the lowest score at the end of each round will be eliminated. Correct answers score two points, and one point being awarded if it was a second guess, following the incorrect answer from another con contestant. Get one wrong and I'll take two points off you. Press X to buzz in and A to answer if you can. Now let's meet tonight's victims. Uh, I mean contestants, shall we? Introducing on the left, it's my gorgeous slim sister, Mingella. On the right, we have my lovely, uh, uh shapely sister, Blob Elder. And in the middle, just some loser bear called Banjo. Let's start with round one. One gets two. Seconds. How many times did Banjo defeat Klungo? Uh, three. Because I've just beaten him now. Which sea based creature is not seen in Jolly Roger B? Um. Dunce, anyone else? We've not seen a shark. We haven't seen a shark, so. About time to! What was wrong with the aliens UFO in Jolly Rancher's Lagoon? Um... The computer was got What?! It was the other one? You plank anyone else? Was it run out of fuel? Because I know you had to power it up. Oh, I think it was fuel then. Alright. Which one of these is Balls Kids? Goggles. And he has Specky as well. Who lives in Honeybee's Hive? They're just honeybee. <laughs> Which color Jinjo does not appear in the game? Uh, gray, because they passed away. Fair enough, you killed them. What item of clothing Banjo is in the washing machine firing Grunty Industries? Um... Shorts? Even though I think they're underwear, but they say shorts. Which of these is an area in Grunty Industries? The repair to bot? Yes! What falls from Icicle Grotto roof in Hellfire Peaks? Um, icicles. Um, and then she got it right. Take a look at this scene. Uh, oh yeah, it's the Easter egg. Banjo Kazooie, Perfect Dark, Banjo Tooie, Jeff Foster Gemini. And... Oh, uh, I know this. It's Grunty Industries. It's not Bottle's House, no. Take a look at the scene. It's from Glitter Gulch Mine. Oh, it's asking a different question. Um, Some of them? No. You halfway, anyone else? Many of the crates were open. Were many, uh, no, how many of the crates were open? None of them. I'm surrounded by morons. Which Banjo-Kazooie character is found on the side of the book? It's 2E. No, not Mr. Vile. You halfway, anyone else? It's Tootie. It's not Brentilda. It's Tootie, Banjo's sister. Alright. Where does King Jingling live? Um, in a throne room. In Ginger Village. Take a look at the scene. Um, the Star Moon Sun. It's in Mayhem Temple. An orange sun. And Oh, I got it right. I didn't know what question it was going to be. What is usually about Master Jiggy Wiggy? What's unusual about him? 
It's got a jiggy for a head. Yeah. A lucky guess. Which of these areas is found in Mayhem Temple? Um... Not bad. That's that's the end of round one. Looks like my sister Blobbell is as thick as her waist, and her score was minus four. Is as low as her IQ. Here's your conclusion prize, Blobby. And you die. <laughs> on a wonton, which gets squished. Time to move on to round two. Here's a scene from the game. Uh, that's the Dodgem Dome. Well, what question is it asking? Dodgem Games, okay. I'll accept that. What's found inside Glow Google Lens but do gold? A shooting game. I'll accept that. What is the name of the train that travels between the worlds? Shuffy. Uh, yeah. Which of these worlds is the most has the most letters in the game? Um I think Pterodactyl Land? Yes! Fair enough. What colour are the clockwork kazooie eggs? The red with yellow spots. I accept that. Let's look at the. I like how Minjolo doesn't have any points yet. Um, what question is this? I don't know. Six. Dunce! Anyone else? How many rays did the sun. Oh! I think it's eight then. Probably eight. Yep, it's eight. I'll give you one point. What is the main danger in Grunty Industries Qualified Control? Uh, toxic gas. Yeah. Sometimes I don't know these. Which of these areas is not found in Mayhem Temple? Dot Gunfields. I don't remember Gunfields. Take a look at the scene in the game. Um. Is it Chompers Belly or the Big Fish? You fall at anyone else. Oh. No, it must be the big fish then. A grunty's guts? <laughs> Since when have we been in there? What wall dwelling fiery object attacks you in Fail Fire Peaks? Uh. A giant head? Yes. A lucky guess. Which one of these moves is learned in Jolly Roger's Lagoon? Um, Talon Torpedo. You know it all. What is the name of Mumbo's cyborg in person? Uh, Mingi Jongo. <laughs> what, were the what were the other names there? I didn't see them. Ugh. The Pump Master 2. But what question is it going to ask? We'll actually wait for this one. This is a... You plank! Anyone else? Oh! Oh, because it said Pumper Master up there, and not Pump Master. Well, it was 50 out of 50. Here's a scene from the game! Jolly Rogers the Goon, but what question is it going to ask? I don't know. Let's see. Right. You half-wit, anyone else? How many letters on the sign? Oh. I don't know. One point, I suppose. Uh, that's the end of round two. It seems like my sister Mingella has also been beaten by that useless bear. Time to say goodbye, Minji. Sounds suggestive. Uh -huh. <laughs> well, she's dead. <laughs> now listen carefully, dunce. I'm changing the rules for the final round. To make it harder, I won't show your, you the answers unless you buzz in. Um, if you don't know the answer, I'll let you press L or R to pass or move on, on to the next question. I'll set a nice little score for you to beat within the given time. I wish you plenty of bad luck. Let's play. Banjo Lost or Grunty Squash? It's the final round! Which of the banjo only moves is activated by holding R and the right stick up? Um. Sack pack. Not bad. What is the color of the revolting lights in floor 3 of Grunty Industries? I don't know. Is it yellow? Yes! A lucky guess! What was wrong with the pirate in Jollies? Uh, seasick. Not bad! What colour is Mumbo's Feeble Energy Staff Attack? 
pink. <laughs> and Gwensi has 15 points, by the way. What problem did the swimming pool kids in Jolly Rancher's Bay not have? The pool was filthy. One of them had three arms. No, it was filthy. No. What? <laughs> There's two grunty heads there. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> I don't know. I guess seven. No. You're wrong. <laughs> Grunty's head's still there. That's so funny. Uh, I don't really know. Perhaps you'll never win. What mine-related feature is not found in Glee Gorge Mine? Um... A drill. We don't see a drill there, so... What is target then? Man, got off. Target shooting. You know it all. In Gritty Industries, what do the mean factory workers try to whack you with? A wrench, just like Ratchet and Clank. <laughs> what spell does Mumbo perform in Witchy World? Uh, it was... No, not Life Force. Power. Not bad. What spell does Mumbo perform in Gritty Industries? Um, it was... EMP, or EMP. EMP. What is packed in Grunty Industries packing room? A uh, twink, please. I know it all. What is the name of Jinjo's King? It's Jingling. Not single, not single long or dingling. It's Jingling. A lucky guess. What is Mr. Patch announcing? What you will? Uh, it was a strange, wobbly, inflatable thing. Not bad. What ben which Banjo Kazooie world is not seen in Banjo Tooie on a picture? Uh, Gobi's Desert. I think Gobi's Desert. No, it's Gobi's Valley, not Gobi's Desert. What is Witchy World's inflatable castle called? Crazy Castle. Just like Bugs Bunny's Crazy Castle. What is the combination of Cloud Cuckoo Land's uh, 1984? It's not 2001 like Banjo Tooie's PAL release. What can be raced around in? A clockwork mouse. You know it all. Which witch bird is used to flap the guy to clock up that central cavern? Um, pork chop. Hot dog sausage. There we go. I'll accept that. Oh, I've got 30 points. That's the end of the final round. What a useless score that. Huh? What's wrong with the scoring system? It must be broken! You can't have got that many points! No, 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 no! I declare the winning valid due to faulty equipment! Oh dear, so what happens now? Uh, I don't know! Any ideas? You can escape in a cowardly fashion like in Banjo-Kazooie before we kick your bony bum! Bony ass! Yes, I climbed Bang's bird brain! Fortunately, I've built a rocket under this booth for the very reason. I'll be waiting for you at the top like last time. But this time, you'll be ones taking the fall. She waves goodbye, apparently. The gun chamber? Right, come on, Kazooie. Let's go and see where that door uh, that's just open leads to. Do you reckon that's the end of the game? No, it's not! I doubt it. We've not had the credits yet. We need to beat Grunty, though. That's true. Okay, let's go. And then it crushes that. And it's not the end of the game, guys. Even though you get the credits now. In memory of Chris Mullender. What, has he passed away? I didn't know. But yeah, this is the credits of Banjo-Tooie. Banjo-Tooie was brought to you by, well, Rareware, of course. Because <laughs> they're a great British company. The original Banjo-Tooie team. Alright. So, yeah, that was, um... That was Banjo-Tooie. I guess. So I guess, um, well, we haven't finished Banjo 2 yet, but we get the credits now. It's just like the first game. So, yeah, so apparently, so we're going to fight Gruntilda. We're going to fight Gruntilda, of course, uh, but we're also going to try and access a few secrets. We're going to try and get that secret cheat code as well. The original rare testing team. So I guess they have the original people that's not from Nintendo, and then and then the new team. 
I guess, at porting the game. Okay. God, my jaw hurts from all the voice acting. Oh my god. Thanks to the following rare people. Thanks to the following rare people, yeah. So yeah, we're gonna... There we go, the Banjo-Tooie XBLA team. So, Xbox Live Arcade team. There we go, so then this is the new team. Blue Mumbo's house and not the pink one. That was Mingy Jongo's house for us. Oh, a flying bird, I want to eat it. But it's a pterodactyl, so it's gross. Alright. <laughs> there's a guy with a wrench. Inspired by Ratchet and Clank. Oh, that's all ages. Rare team. Alright. And there's Ilo Hags from Club Cuckoo and Distance. Oh, and there's Cauldron Keep. The MGSE team, what does that stand for? Mac oh, Microsoft Game Studios, but then the E, what does that stand for? <laughs> well, I guess it's gonna show the same scenes again now. Because the credits is again longer, just like the previous game. There we go, Xbox Live Arcade Team. Okay. When's it gonna end? When's it gonna end? This when's this credits gonna end? It, it takes ages. Like it should actually, it should really play when uh when you defeat Gruntilda and not in like the middle of the game. It's weird. Okay, VMC. Okay. For the Xbox Live Arcade testing team. Okay. Okay. I don't know why that takes ages to load there. Like I get, I am on Rare, Re my Rare Replay disc is, is on disc, but the, it installs on the hard drive all the games, so it shouldn't take that long to load. Like, come on. Oh, there we go, the Rare Testing Team. MGS Product Testing, what, Metal Gear Solid Product Testing? <laughs> That's what MGS stands for, Metal Gear Solid. Well, it's got to, I, I, I guess it means Microsoft Game Studios, I'm guessing, as well. It's probably that. Microsoft Game Studios. <laughs> and I like how at the top on the top left corner you can clearly see Jam Jars. Because he is pee pee. 
localization team, so people who like translated the game into other languages. And I can't tell if that planet if that planet is supposed to be Saturn or your anus. I don't know. Dolby and the Dolby symbols are trademarks of Dolby Laboratories. And <laughs> you can see Saberman sleeping there. 2009 Microsoft. Right, this should be the end then of the credits. Yep, it is. So we get this cutscene here. Do, 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 do. At the B.O.B. controller. Well, don't just stand there. There's still time to save my brother and jingling by reversing the gun settings. But, but there's no instructions. No problem. I'll just press a few buttons and see what happens. We'll press the right one. No, I, uh, uh, I press the blow button. That should do it. You crazy feathered punk! Anything might hurt. But no! I wonder what will hit down there. What will hit down there? Well, this time it's going forward and it's not going. It's not. It's not sucking it. It's. It's not <laughs> in it. It's blowing it. So it's. <laughs> in it. Look! It's working! Ha! I believe you owe me an apology, Dom Jaws! Not a chance! And Jingling's back! Thanks, guys! Life's not much fun as a zombie! Well, no. Even though you can't die as a zombie, we can't kill you. Balls next thing, Kazooie! He's been lifeless for quite a while, so I think you'd better turn it up to full power. Not until Soldier Boy apologizes. For what? D Sorry, Kazooie. Thank you. And now, now it's gonna do the same thing for Bottles. Even though Bottles died from like the. The attack and not the BOB thing. And <laughs> his ghost is still there. And he's like, oh, 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 that's so good. <laughs> he's like. And then the ghost goes back in him. And he's back alive! Except he's still full of smoke. Oh no! Look at the time! I'm really late for dinner! Miss Bottles will kill me! Please, my wife! <laughs> His wife doesn't look pleased. I don't care how burnt it is, you're still eating it! <laughs> look at her eyes behind the glasses. It's not my fault. The witch killed me, and I've only just come back to life. Yes, I'm sure you have, dear. Well, Banjo tried to tell you that, but... You didn't actually really know. Oh, hey, Jingling. Oh, and Klungo. Goodness! Who might you two be? Yo, I'm King Jingling, and this fine fellow is Klungo. Being bad freed Klungo from evil clutches of mistress. They saved me from an eternity as one of the undead. So we come round to celebrate. Sounds good to me. Each of your balls. Oh, lovely. I'll make us some nice scones. But where's Banjo? He's real. He's a real hero. I think he's eating it now. Mistress escaped. So brave bird and bird going after her. They'll join us later, but 
Let's now let's party with a confetti. And <laughs> Coin goes like, "Oh no, this might be the end now. We have the we had the credits, and everyone's all right again." What about Grunty? Oh, I think we ought to just take a quick look at the top of the tower. But there's no way up there. Yes, there is. Nice try, Banjo. But I would reckon that opening below the gun over there probably leads us up. Uh, I was hoping you hadn't seen that. But... Oh, and we see Dingpot. Hey, Dingpot. How are you doing there? Why, hello there, Mr. Banjo. I'm Dingpot. Remember me? No, not really. I helped you at the end of Banjo Kazooie. Oh yeah, the old stink pot. You're so cruel, but hey, why not jump in for a nice stinky bonus? Must we? I've only just gotten my feathers clean from last time. If you just go in and then. Uh, and then your items just get replenished, so if you don't have enough eggs and that, uh, it refills them for you. Then you go over here. And then the final boss is just here. Well, first there's a warp pad. But we're not gonna do the final boss yet. We're gonna first do... Not only that secret from uh, Witchy World again, but also we're gonna see... What happens if we can go to Bottle's house? Because now Bottle's is there. Right, first I'll go to the Pine Grove. Right, here we go. And then... And then we're gonna go to Madame Grunty again. Right, Witchy world. Let me go in there. Let's see if we can get a cheat code. When extra fire eggs, I don't need fire eggs. Though. Wait a bit. Oh my god! Stop giving me a beating! Grunty. Well, I got my energy back. <laughs> Thanks to the cheat. You win an extra any bar. I don't need a refill. I'm not gonna be alcoholic. A bit. God damn it, Grunty! Alright. Please give me the code. I want the code. You want an extra energy bar refill? Oh my god. Right. You want a bit. Are you kidding me? Surprised it's not gonna close yet. If it does, then we'll go to Ball's house and then. Gold feathers. I don't need gold feathers. I've replenished all my items with ding dingy pot. With ding pot the naughty. Well, he's not naughty actually. Wait a bit. Oh my god! Stop beating me up! You're not my mom! I don't need eggs. I've got 200 already. Bit I want the code! Oh, hold on, guys. Okay, guys, I just had a phone call. That's why we paused there. Uh, please. We're an extra bar. No. It's not Is it gonna close? It's just gonna stay there, isn't it? we an extra. Oh, now it's closed. Right, let's go to Bottle's house then, and then we'll come back here. Right, off to Bottle's house we go. So, off in Jinjo Village, we're gonna go to Bottle's house. Uh, which is down this way. Uh, we're just gonna... So, there's Bottle's house. And... It's closed, but... Hear that? They're having a party. Let's go close. Sorry, guys. 
but you can't come in the party until the witch's history. Yes, Baron Blood must go back to castle and bash mistress. Hurry along, Banjo, dear. I'll save you one of my scones. Okay. What if you try to go in again? You're not coming in! Please go and defeat the witch in her castle. There's a good bear. Yes. No, pass can go another scorn. Okay. But I need to go back to Witchy World to get a cheat code. Because I want it bad. Now, please give me a cheat code. You win. <gasps> yes! The secret cheat is get jiggy. Activate it in the. Oh my god! Yes! I got it! Oh my god! Oh, first try this time! So after going to Bottle's place, I finally get the cheat code! Oh my god! After all the hassle! Jesus Christ! Oh! Right, let's go to Mayhem Temple then, I guess. And then let's enter the cheat code. Uh, get Jiggy, it's called. So, we got to... <sighs> Finally, Grunty's being nice once for all. Instead of being a mean girl. Being a mean woman, like she always is. <sighs> Alright. Alright. Oh my god, we've got it finally. Got it into the right, it's get jiggy, so get jiggy. Jiggy wiggy. No not well, it's not jiggy wiggy. Where's G? G, where is it? Wait, oh it's there. Cause when it's used you don't even know where to find it. Right. The get jiggy cheat will activate the signposts in Jiggy Wiggy's temple. So what the signposts do, they're another way of giving you hints on what jiggies you don't know where they are. And there's a signpost for each world, so we don't, even though it's pointless because we can activate the, oh, it's the sixth chi, I thought it was the eleventh. Um, even though it's pointless, uh, we'll still activate it anyway. So then we've got all legit cheats in the game, so uh, now let's go to Grunty, I guess. Alright, back to Cauldron Keep in from the Ilo Hex Quagmara. We're just gonna go right here. Look at these. <laughs> I actually didn't get it. Please don't hit me. God. Alright, climb up here. Alright, and then. Uh, we'll go this side this time. Then we're just gonna warp up. Top of the tower. And before we go in there, <laughs> that's a weird pose. Let's just look at all of our totals, all our objects and items. Well, there's two doublings, of course. We have every stop and swap. For stop and swap two, I'm not sure if I've got all of them or not. Or if I need to get another one, so. Because I know some of these you get from the eggs you get, and then I think the other you get from beating the game, and the other if you die 40 times in, like, boss rush, I believe. I don't know if I've got them all, though. Uh, so we've got, oh no, not again. Lucky loser. Better than a slab. And the women is, calma, 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 chameleon. <laughs> no, not really. Alright, um, uh, then gingos. We have every gingo in the game. And then for totals, we'll just look at them all, then. My game total. Doesn't really matter too much. Uh, so Spiral Mountain is finished. Arlo Hags is finished. Mayhem Temple complete. Glitter Gulch Mine complete. Witchy World complete. Jolly Rogers Lagoon complete. Pterodactyl Land complete. Grunty Industries complete. Hailfire Peaks complete. And Cloud Cuckoo Land complete. We just need to do the final boss in Cauldron Keep now. 
and then we finish Banjo Tui. So let's go, shall we? Oh, looks like there's no one here. We should go home now. Wow, it's one heck of a view from up here. Sure is, but doesn't it seem strange that Gruntilda isn't up here to meet us? Obviously chickened out. I've enjoyed our adventure, but let's get back to the card game. Card game? What, that game you cheated on, Kazooie? And you're going to get banned on Twitch for that? <gasps> it's that drill from the beginning. Tag one. Monstrous mechanical mud muncher. Oh, God. Ah, uh, Banjo. Oh, look at the size of that. I'm sure it wasn't that big before. How could we have missed it? Well, because you haven't seen it, I don't think. And surprise, Gruntilda is in there. Finally, after two years, revenge time. Don't bet on it, Bone Brain. We'll see, little bird. We'll see. Where's the laser button? Darn it. Someone passed the manual for this thing. Ah, yes. Here we go. And so we face Gruntilda in this giant drill, the Hag One. Apparently that's the license. And then... Although the quiz was over, did you think again? I still got quite a few question cards up my sleeve. Answer them correctly, maybe I'll go a little easier on you. What is my name spelled backwards? Gruntilda, the first one. Damn, drat! That's correct! I'll only use my slower attack. Prepare yourself for an unhealthy dose of spells. So what this means, if you answer correctly, she'll use the slow attack. If you answer incorrectly, she'll use the faster one. And it's recommended to use um, a grenade eggs here. Oh, one nail left the pesky bear. More lasers are required. How do I switch them all on? This one, lovely. Here we go again. And we're gonna we're gonna leave that energy there. Right, I want to get the grenade egg, so... There we go. There we go. Oh, there we go. What is the name of my beautiful life-sucking thing? B.O.B. It's just like the rapper's name. The, the wrong way! Wrong way, Banjo! And thank God the homing eggs work. <laughs> Not again! Time for something new, methinks. Plenty more tricks left in this beauty. Activate the mortar cannon. Bombs away. Oh, now the bombs are coming out. And we're gonna jump. You're just gonna jump out of the cannons here. Just like that. And then, I'm just gonna wait for Grunty again. Which Banjo Kazooie character wasn't seen in Banjo Tui? Uh, Mr. Vile, we didn't see him anywhere. Right, and then shoot an egg, just like that. Pfft. Well, our energy refills anyway, so I guess we don't need these cones. I need more firepower. Bring out the other mortar cannon. Double bombs away. Okay. All right. Whoa! They have more bombs, and I wanted the grenade eggs badly. Alright, come on. There we go. Which ginger family had the most members? Black. Alright. We just shoot more grenade eggs at Grunty's face. There we go. Alright. What next? Fetch the cannons back in. Open the exhaust port. Oh yes! Feel the power of that V10 beast! Crack the drill up! Let's get him! Or not! Because although you can take damage, it's not even worth it. 
Like, he tries to get us here. Or she tries to get us, I mean. Go. And then you have to jump over. You have to be careful there. You gotta be careful. Alright, the drill's after me. Help. Oh, no. No, I think you gotta jump. And I took damage. But my health will be regained in a moment anyway. Yeah, there we go. Alright, here we go. What is the total number of legs on all Humble Wombas transformations? I don't know. Is it 16? No. Wrong answer! You'll be facing my faster attack now. So it's much harder to dodge. But I can still dodge it easily. So uh, attack is faster. So. Alright, there we go. Oh, I took damage! <laughs> oh my god. What's wrong with this machine? It's going strange. Oh, that's when you got to... That's when you got to get your... Oh. It's not my fault. The gear. But it must be faulty. Nope. That is when you got to get your clockwork kazooies. And then use that to then go in the back. But we missed. So we got to try again. we got to wait a while. <laughs> well, all the way behind it. Well, it's butthole. <laughs> right, there we go. Gotta go in there. And then, you have these two things. You want to destroy these both, and there's an enemy in here. You try and kill the enemy, but it's not really worth it. Eh? Uh, I heard an explosion! What was that burning smell? Oh, and then you gotta do the fighting again. And then the four lasers this time. I need a clockwork kazooie egg. Oh, that's close. Alright. Right. Come on, get me out of this madness. There we go. Do, 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 do. Oh, okay. What kind oh, whoa, I didn't even read that question. <laughs> and I got it right. <laughs> oh my god. That was incredible. Right. I guess we'll do a cut look to egg. Ah, oh, it didn't work. Right, there we go. Go around there. Go in there. There we go. Oh, there's two enemies. You've got to be careful of these enemies. Do not touch them. Boom! Destroy both of them. And then... Oh, no! We're losing power! No! Don't stop, Mr. Drew. My lovely lasers! Get someone found for a tow truck! Right, that's it. I've had enough. We fight to the death. Right, so then you still have... Now, she'll always use her fast attack now. So, meaning... It's still hard. But you just gotta attack her with the grenade eggs. Have we got any more tricks left? Ah, yes. The minions. There he goes. Go get them, doofus. Right, and then you just gotta attack her more. And she's using a slow attack now. And she goes up to 15 here. Ah, of course. Why didn't I think of this earlier? Release the toxic gas. Mmm, sand and mustard gas flavor. My favorite. Ew, that's disgusting. Maybe that's why. Gas a lot. Get out of my way, minion. Right. Okay, numbskulls, time for a biggest, baddest spell like a muster. Prepare to join your body bottles. You'll wish you'll never take on the mighty Gruntilda Winky Bunyan. Winky Bunyan? Is that your last name, then? Uh, um, no, of course not. But don't you go telling anyone or I'll sue you. Whatever you say, Winky. Now die! Alright. Okay. Alright, we just gotta... We gotta... Now this attack is almost undodgeable. I guess I'll collect these energies first. Alright, one, two, three! Two, three, go! Ow! Oh, oh no! The spell! I dropped it! Quick! Somebody get rid of it before it...
explodes. Whew. Well, we sure saw the old Winky Bunyan again, huh, Banjo? Yup, we certainly did. Come on, let's go down to Bottles for that party. Good idea. Well done, Banjo and Kazooie. <laughs> Bottles are sleeping. Seems a bit quiet for a party. Sure does. Hey, Bottles boy! Where's the party? Well, uh, it's finished, I'm afraid. That Klungo sure was hungry. He's eaten everything in the house. Mm, Bumbo wanted to boogie. Big heap, Bumbo. It's all your fault, bird brain! You should have dealt with that bony crow quicker! Well, at least I wasn't hiding in my silos like a coward. Wait, you feathered! Ho ho ho! Useless Wamba hit in Wigwam too. Shut up, or Wamba turn, you turn stupid shaman into frog. Me saw my gold statue to kick ugly Wamba's butt. Stop it, all of you! You can go outside if you want to argue. Okay. Kazooie's got a better idea. Yeah, does anyone fancy a kick around? Kick around? What's that punk? Follow us and find out. Oh boy, <laughs> what is it? We're kicking Grunzelda's head! Yeah, let's kick her face, there we go. It's what she deserves all along. <laughs> so funny. Take that, witch! Yes, much fun. And yeah, in the Japanese version, it's a sack that resembles a cloven instead. Mumbo right, big heap fun. Hustle to me! <laughs> it's so funny. And then look at this. <laughs> right, I fell out. Oh, I think her eye just fell out. And her eye still f falls out in the Japanese version as well. Y'all be sorry, all of you. Just you wait until Banjo Free! Which doesn't exist, as of now. And Captain Blubber's on the Saucer Peril. And that is the end! <laughs> Got it. Oh, I'm still not online, oh come on. Connect to Xbox Live, please. Please connect to me, please. Please connect me. I guess it's taken ages for me to sign it. Oh, there we go. Oh, oh boy. Okay, so that is Banjo Tui, guys. Oh wow, have I beaten it in a quicker time? Oh my god, I have. I've beaten it quicker than my previous save. Wow. Wasn't expecting that really, but okay, I guess. This file can go in the bin, and then I'll copy that previous save so we can, so I can then, so I can then, in fact, no, I don't need to, because I think I'm thinking of playing the game again one day anyway, so, yeah, that's so cool, so, uh, our last thing here, so, bosses here, uh, you have mini games, so all the mini games, and all the bosses, Facing Klungo a few times, targets and all can call Mr. Patch, Lord Whoop, Fack Fack, uh, Terry, Weldar, Chili Billy and Chili Willy, Mingy Jongo, and Hagwon, which is Gruntilda. Uh, so yeah. And then in the cinema, you get to watch all the game's cutscenes, so like the opening, uh, all these. 
And then you have this bonus one here called Character Parade. What is that, you may ask? The credits again. But it's just the other... You have been watching the Gold Goliath. Well, we've not been watching him all the time. He's just standing there now. And it's just like a cast of uh, characters and enemies, I think. Yeah, Bovina is the... Uh, is the cow. Slumber. That's the snake we had to sneak the jiggy up from. Then... Oh, Officer Uno Gopaz. That's his name. That tiger. That won't let Banjo and Kazooie in, but it'll let the Stony in. Chief Bloat to sin. So yeah, we'll show off these characters and then we'll end the video off. And then that's Banjo Tooie, I guess. Yeah, Target Zan, who is the boss. Mayhem Temple. We got Bully and Bill. So the characters go by the world order, so. We have Guild Birder. Canary Mary, who also appears in Cloud Cuckoo Land, but you first encounter in Glow Gulch Mine. Old King Cole, who is in the Chuffy Train. It's surprising how the train looks big for Banjo, but when he's in, it's even bigger, it seems. Yeah, it's Conga. It's now a circus leader. Wearing a pumpkin hat and a pumpkin clothing. Big Al, who sneezes on the burger, and then he gives you the snotty burger. That's gross. I'm surprised everyone's not infected from his germs. Right, and Solly Joe, which thankfully sneezes away from the fries. <laughs> I'm not getting his germs. They're the Saucer of Peril. Which is the UFO. Yeah, Mr. Patch, aka an inflatable Yoshi. <laughs> well, kind of. <laughs> and then Jolly Roger. It's just a frog. I guess he left Jolly Roger Bay then. The Merry Maggie May Malpass. Mm. And Pono. <laughs> Is he like a squirrel or something? I don't know. Or is it like a raccoon? A tip top and tip top junior. Ah, oh, so it's tip top junior the the baby turtle. And then Trotty, the three armed pig, or the two armed pig in the Japanese version I've heard. Captain Black Eye, <laughs> and he has a gun on him. I didn't know that. I didn't see that before. And Piggles. I would expect the pigs to be together, and then, and then it would be Captain Black Eye, Captain Blubber. <laughs> he has a private room there, <laughs> next to him. There, I wonder what he does in there. Oh, and then we have the aliens. So we have Alf. And then Betty. And who's the other one? Gamo. And so the baby aliens will be shown later. So. And then crispy bacon. Well, I guess pigs do make bacon, so <laughs> it makes sense. And he's wearing UK shorts. Lord with fact fact. And no, it's not a swear word, guys. <laughs> so we're not dropping the F bomb there. And there's Dippy, thirsty dinosaur. They can drink it as well. Oh, and there's the rock nuts. They're annoying. But you have to explode their arse. And then... And then they die. And then there's Onga Bunga. Smelling his fingers. And we have Oogle Boogle. Which are the nice cavemen. He's got massive toes. And then Scrotty. Fat dinosaur. Isn't it like a triceratops or something? And then a scrat. 
Sounds like an Ice Age character. You know that squirrel from Ice Age? It sounds like that. And then Scrap. And then Scrip. And then there's the other dinosaur. So Scrap, Scrip, and Scrop. Stompadon. It's just a dinosaur foot, though. Oh, and the controller vibrates here. <laughs> uh, we have Chomposaurus and Lunch. Oh, so, so Lunch is the Unga Bunga that lets us in his cave. Okay. Oh, and then he's gonna get eaten. That's so funny. And then we have Terry, who is the main pterodactyl of this land. Uh, Logo, yeah, he's a toilet. I want to take a dump in him right now. <laughs> no, just kidding. I want to take a dump in him. I don't know. And then Skivvy. Oh, the, they're Skivvies. They're, they're the rabbits. Because <laughs> they're just called worker rabbits, really. Most time. Yeah, Welder. Who spits blue fire. Then we have Biggerfoot. So not Bigfoot, it's Bigger Foot. Mm. We have Saber Man from his own game, Saber Wolf. Oh, and then behind him is the Ice Key Door, where we get the Mega Globo. Yeah, Alphet. Yeah, and look at these babies. Do they look adorable or something? And yeah, he's got a Jinjo toy. Yeah, Bedetta. Got like a mirror or something, or like a shake toy. And then Gambetta. <laughs> oh no, Gambetta, not Gambetta. No. <laughs> it's not like, it sounds like the Game Boy emulator. <laughs> and Boggy, who just farted. Because <laughs> he's fat. He's <laughs> like chubby. <laughs> and we have Miss Boggy with massive boobs. <laughs> and then we're going to have their children. Yeah, Groggy, he's the fat one. Too much. It's probably one to be acting like his dad or something. And we have Soggy. We wanted fries. And then Moggy is the other one in the red shirt. Yep. I'm surprised now the bears have cloves now. <laughs> like in the previous game they didn't. Oh, there's Gobi. Which we steal the his water again. And he's now got a beard. I don't even know if camels have beards. And then Mildred Ice Cube. Which we killed. <laughs> and we have Chili Billy. <laughs> and then we have the more inappropriate dragon name next. Chili Willy. Because <laughs> I guess they want to make a lot of inappropriate jokes in this game. And then George Ice Cube. <laughs> and then, uh, what's going to be next here? Yeah. Oh, yeah, the Super Stash. What, that's his animation he does when Banjo Kazooie are not there? Wait, 1984. And Guffo. Yeah, he's just a can. And then Jolly's Juice at the back there. And then, oh, Snacky Fatty Chocks. <laughs> yeah, Mr. Fit. It's like an elephant or something. He's wearing a wear, wear outfit. Yeah, Mingi Chongo. Who is the fake Mumbo Jumbo? The Master Jiggy Wiggy. <sighs> With a jiggy for a head. And then next is gonna be his Dormite. Yep, the disciple of Jiggy Wiggy. The one I coughed at when I was doing his voice acting. <laughs> Which was so funny. <laughs> then there's Heggy. It's a bird. Does the stop and swap eggs for us? And then Honeybee. And believe it or not, in the game's files is a texture of her moves without the yellow things. I'm not joking. And then there's Cheeto, Broken Cheeto, or Sad Cheeto, it looks like. And then Dinkpot. Okay. 
I'm surprised the other cauldrons are not in this game. And then there's Goggles, who has a Donkey Kong toy. And I'm surprised it's still in the Xbox version. Although I guess one of the questions has changed in Grunty's quiz. And then there's Specky. And he actually wears Ash's hat from Pokemon, except the L is upside down. <laughs> and then we have Mrs. Bottles with a banjo tooie cock. <laughs> and a picture of Bottles behind her. Oh, and then there's Bottles and Royston. Oh my god, he's eating Banjo's fish! <laughs> I wonder what Banjo would be like. And there's Clungo. When the controller vibrates again. <laughs> we have King Jingling. And then who's that pink fellow there? Ah, oh, don't look at his pants. Uh, toots! Yeah, I think it's the same toots that Ruby had in uh, Banjo Kazooie. And then Jam Jars. <laughs> Bottle's brother, apparently. And then Humble Wonder. Just sitting in a wigwam. And then Blob Belder. The fat witch. <laughs> Smelling armpits. She has a cat that's not named. With Mingella, the slim witch. Who looks ugly. Mm. Then we have Gruntilda, who's a skeleton now. Okay. And then M Mumbo Jumbo. He's not sitting on his throne for some reason. He's just standing there. And there we are. And of course, Banjo. Where's Kazooie? And Kazooie! <laughs> She's there. I like how they're separate and <laughs> not together. And I think that's the cast all done. Yep. The Tower of Tragedy. <laughs> or in the Japanese version, Tower D Quiz. So, yeah, that is Banjo Tui, uh, guys. So, uh, show off the achievements on Xbox you can get. So yeah, yeah, this, the Hatch to Future, you get from the Stop and Swap eggs. Yeah, you get one for saving Saber Man. Uh, you freeze all, yeah, this one will be tricky for some because people don't really expect to do that a lot. And then this one, it doesn't matter which minigame you do, you either 20 Solstice Clinkers, oh yeah, the Clinkers were the poop things uh, in Grunty Industries, or the Mines. You get 20 of them. Oh, you shoot 20 of them, so it's not Mines. And then score 60 points in a... Yeah, and then... And one of them is defeating old King Cole. And the other, the first Klongo. And this one, collect a note, an egg, a feather, and a ginger to get this. Okay. And then defeat Grunty, and then make a rainbow. <laughs> 20 bad guys need to go. Yeah, you have to kill 20 enemies. And then, yeah, defeat Grunty in the final battle. So, yeah. And then, uh, for the leaderboards, hopefully if it'll connect to the internet, there we go. But it doesn't go by level now, it instead goes by, like, the, uh, different modes, so the game total. So there's my score there. Eight hours, wow. I've actually beaten it that long, wow. That's the quickest I've beaten it, okay. Okay. Alright, so. Yeah, that is Banjo Tooie, guys. So. Really great journey here. I would like to thank you guys for watching this series of uh, videos. Uh, thanks for watching these. These Banjo Kazooie and Banjo Tooie uh, playthroughs that I'm done is for celebrating uh, the first anniversary of my very own made Banjo Kazooie anti piracy video that I created a, a year ago uh, to make it, trying to make it part of the anti-piracy uh, trend. I don't know if it's there though. And also thanks to um, YouTuber Thumbs Up Master for sharing one of my videos as well. Uh, the one where I beat Grunty, Gruntilda, in the first Banjo-Kazooie. 
yeah, and he he's a great YouTuber who does other Banjo Kazooie content, so go visit his channel if you can. And as for me, well, we're done with Banjo Kazooie and Tui for now. Uh, I've not played uh, Grunty's Revenge or Banjo Pilot or Nuts and Bolts yet, uh, so uh, so they'll probably be in the future. They will not be now, unfortunately. Uh, Kazooie and Tui were the only ones I've played. And no, I've not even played the uh, the game that's similar to it, Ukulele. I've not played that at all. Don't even have a copy as of this video. So, yeah. Anyways, Video Game Jam Poop is going to sign off here. I'll see you guys in the next video. Well, not next video. Uh, in, in an XLP. I don't know what I'll do. So, I'll see you guys next time, I guess. Um, okay. I'll see you guys next time, guys. I'll see you guys. Right. See you next time, guys. Bye!